Hi, my name is Kelly and I'm a volunteer with Appalachian Wildlife Refuge. Please follow along on all of our social media platforms to see additional videos on animals in our care in our North Carolina facility. I am also a second grade teacher, so I love books. And in this time of online learning and online teaching, I thought I'd share some of my favorite woodland animal stories with you in our Tuesday Tales. Even though these books are fiction, they can teach us so much, right? from family and friends to problem solving. And in today's Tuesday Tales, I have Caldecott winning Bear Came Along by Richard Morris. This book is perfect for the time that we're in with the pandemic because we're all in that pandemic together and these woodland animals are in for a journey together. I wanna give a special shout out to my friends Ryan and Benjamin who let me borrow their brand new book and to read it aloud to you. Um, I also have a couple of friends here for you. So I'm a teacher and I'm trying to make online learning a little bit exciting and creative. So I ordered a cup of caterpillars so we can watch this journey also through um, our read aloud. So this is day six of me having them and we have five caterpillars that are eating and growing and getting round and getting ready to get into their chrysalises. So they're my new quarantine pals. So be sure to watch to the end of the book and we're going to tell you our answer to last week's Tuesday Tales trivia question and then you'll hear this week's Tuesday Tales trivia question where you'll get the answer in the following week. So this is Bear Came Along and I know we read books on lots of devices and, and also have our hardcover books and our soft cover paperbacks, but there's nothing like the smell of a brand new book. And I was reading this book and I could just smell the pages. Oh, there's nothing like a fresh brand new book. So Bear came along. Once there was a river that flowed night and day, but it didn't know it was a river until... Bear came along. Bear was just being curious. When he realized what the river could do, but he didn't know he was on an adventure until... Froggy hopped on. Froggy was a lonely frog who was looking for a friend but she didn't know how many she had. Until the turtles showed up. The turtles tried to warn them about things that could go wrong, but they didn't know how to enjoy the ride. Until Beaver climbed aboard. Beaver was born to captain. He knew exactly where to go, but he didn't know about the detours until... The raccoons dropped in. The raccoons were so excited about the twists and turns ahead, but they didn't know they had to be careful. Until they crashed into duck. Duck was so content being right where she was, but she didn't know there was a world to see. Until, take a look at that picture. I see a problem that could be coming. No words on this page, but the pictures say a lot. Again, no words, but the picture says a lot. Love how the book turns this way to really show you the fall. Bear held on to Froggy, Froggy held on to Turtles, Turtles held on to Beaver, Beaver held on to Raccoons, Raccoons held on to Duck, They're still smiling. Oh, what a ride.
so many different animals living their separate lives, but they didn't know until they were in it together. Until... That river came along. And that's it. Love the back cover too. They're all smiling, having fun after they went on their adventure. Thank you for following along. So now I'm going to tell you our answer to last week's Tuesday Tales trivia, which was how many trees did a volunteer with Appalachian Wildlife Refuge plant to help provide shade and native berries for the wildlife? Well, if you guessed 24 trees and two shrubs for a total of 26 new trees, you are correct. And this week's Tuesday Tales trivia is, how many orphan squirrels did we take in from Hurricane Dorian that hit in September of 2019? Once again, take a guess at how many orphan squirrels from Hurricane Dorian that Appalachian Wildlife Refuge took in in September of 2019 and comment below your guesses and tune in next week for the next Tuesday Tales trivia for your new question and for the answer for this week's.